Now, our next story is from the International Space Station, a place fortunately devoid of earthly disputes. You see, the war in Ukraine has not marred cooperation on board the International Space Station. A recent spacewalk, of course, comes as proof. On Thursday, an Italian astronaut joined a Russian cosmonaut for a spacewalk. They embarked on a mission together to install a robotic adapter on the ISS. Our next report gets you all the details. The war in Ukraine has entered its 148th day. The Russian juggernaut is moving ahead. Ukraine and Europe are trying to resist. On ground, the two sides may be enemies. But 400 kilometers above Earth, this rivalry is all but non-existent. Welcome to the International Space Station, a spacecraft devoid of earthly disputes. Americans, Russians, Italians, they're all getting along fine up here. As tensions over Ukraine ricochet back home, a recent spacewalk came as a reminder. On Thursday, an Italian astronaut aboard the ISS joined a Russian cosmonaut for a spacewalk, a rare show of unity. Samantha Cristoforetti in your field of view. Look at these images. This is flight engineer Samantha Cristoforetti from Italy and commander Oleg Artemiev from Russia installing a robotic arm adapter on the ISS. Okay, I'm tethered with this one. So they told us to turn on the satellite in advance. The operation lasted six and a half hours. There wasn't even a trace of disagreement. Interestingly, Cristoforetti also became the first European woman astronaut to embark on a spacewalk. A feat she achieved with assistance from the station's commander, Artemiev, a six-time spacewalker and a Russian. This episode is quite telling. It shows how the ISS is yet to become a frontier, how differences on Earth are yet to spill over into space. A few weeks back, the European Space Agency refused to collaborate with Russia for a lunar mission. A month prior, it suspended a joint mission to Mars with the Russians. Fortunately, the ISS has remained untouched from the politics. There are currently three Americans, three Russians and one Italian working together despite the differences. Here's hoping things remain that way. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.